explain what we try to do in 2A Women, in addition to lobbying legislators, we also, and in addition to training women who are victims of domestic violence, we also spend a lot of our time educating the public. Because we know that if we can help people to understand why red flag laws are unconstitutional, then they can help us have a larger number to counter to approach legislators. There's power in numbers, right? So we educate people. We just did a gun show in Marshall, Arkansas, and we did a class every single hour. One was on red flag laws, one was on stand your ground law. So as we educate people, then they can help us fight from a position of knowledge. And so that is something else that 2A women do. That's why we're passing out handouts right now. One handout tells more about 2A women, who we are, what we do, so that I don't take up any more of your time on that. And the other handout tells you why red flag laws violate your first, second, fourth, fifth, sixth, and eighth amendment rights in detail. So red flag laws are not just a gun rights issue. It's a basic human rights issue. So be sure that you read over those so that when you talk to your legislator, you can make a copy of that, send it to them, and help us stop those red flag laws dead in the tracks. And it doesn't matter what they call them. Sometimes they call them extreme risk protection orders. But it doesn't matter what kind of lipstick you put on that pig, it's still a pig. Okay? Mm -hmm. All right. And they tried to pass those in the legislature. Our next guest.